You may think sun gardens are impossible to make looking beautiful, but that's not the case. What we have to do is work out what's not working, like this weird barbecue area and rather small planting area. And we need to find out what the garden's doing and then work around that in order to make the garden better. So in this space, all of the lines, all of your focal points are being directed to this end fence, which isn't terribly attractive. So if I take away all the clutter and let's deal with the problem that we have, we have to find a way of making this focal point more attractive. We also need to hide some of the buildings behind and maybe conceal some of the fence so that our attention is drawn to this end of the garden, but the end of the garden will be something worth looking at. In a small space, painting the fences a darker, uniform colour will help it feel a bit bigger. Now, I am actually going to draw even more attention to this end fence by adding some horizontal slatting, which I'm going to paint a darker colour. I'm saying, look here. And what have I put here? I've put a mirror. Then the paving will be dark and I've given more space for some planting in front of the mirror because I want the reflections of the plant. I can put a taller plant on the left hand side. There's not a lot of space for planting on the right hand side, but I'm going to make a feature of the planting at the end. How to make a tiny garden feel bigger.